So you need to open a PCA home care in Minnesota. I think this is the right time. The license is coming out fast. And uh, they used to require like four separate insurance and they don't. So if you like thinking about it on the sideline, trying to figure out, should I do a PCA? Should I do a 245D waiver program? Um, I'll, I usually say do it with the PCA and the 245D together. It makes business sense. Uh, just because most a lot of people who have uh, 245D services also have the PCA services. So anyway, if you have been on the sideline trying right, to uh, figure out um, if PCA uh, is the right route or if you're thinking 245D is taking too long, what should you do? I would suggest to go for the PCA agency. And um, it's coming out like, According to the state, 60 days. I just got an email from a friend of mine uh, who I have started for, and he got, his, he got his license today. So that was pretty fast. So, um, so I'm going to say if you are in the arena of thinking about the 245D and the PCA, if you can afford it, do it together. If you can't afford it, then um, do the PCA. And hopefully, once that one is up and running, add the 245D to it. Good luck.